Hi guys, today we're going to be looking at an introduction to sets and notation. Uh, bear in mind this is going to be a very uh, basic introduction to the topic. Um, so first off, we're going to ask, uh, what exactly is a set? So we're going to go off a definition. So the definition of a set, a set is simply a collection of objects. That's all it is. So you can have a set of anything, mathematically. You can have a collection of numbers or words, and these things that are in the set are known as elements. Or if you prefer, members. So when it comes to notation, how can we how can we display or write down a set? So notation. A set whose elements have the property Q, now this is just a general uh, form, so a property can be anything, is denoted in the following way, curly brackets, x colon, or such that, So we have the set X such that X has the property Q. Uh, we can also simply list elements if it's easier to do that. Uh, for example, we have a set X such that X is equal to alpha or X is equal to beta. And we can write that as alpha comma beta and we're listing the elements of the set. Uh, here are some quick examples to give you some idea. So we can have you're just gonna write down some fun examples here. So we can have P being one, two, seven, twelve. Uh, Q is fish, giraffe, Jackie Chan. You get the idea. Um, and just to finish off, uh, how, how do we use this in real mathematics? Well, if we want to donate a set of numbers, we have different number sets, of course. Uh, we can have the natural numbers. Uh, so, natural numbers and the natural numbers are sort of positive integers. Quite self explanatory there. Um, you can use uh, the continuation. Uh, method when it's pretty obvious where you're going. Um, you can't always have three dots uh, if the set isn't clear in its property. Uh, so we can have integers, uh, minus three, minus two, minus one, zero, one, two, three, etc. Um, we can have the last one I'll do is rational numbers. Uh, now we're going to see the notation 
from here when we're writing about the rationals. So we have rationals are numbers m over n such that m and n are elements of the set of numbers that are integers here uh, and n is positive. I hope this video was of some help as a basic introduction to sets and notation. If you have any comments please uh, click below. This is uh, video number one on a uh, multi-video series on sets and notation. Thank you for watching.